Alright folks, welcome back. Welcome back to Sons of the Forest. Uh, for this episode, probably we're gonna be doing some exploration. Let's check out some of the caves in the game and see what we can find. Hopefully we'll find some materials. We'll find more tools, more stuff, more resources. Oh yeah, also we managed to convince Virginia to actually... We managed to befriend Virginia. I gave her some... Did I give her my pistol? I believe I gave her my pistol, yes. I do not have my pistol. I must leave a pistol packed in mama now. Alright. I am going to tell this guy, Calvin, to stay here, relax, chill, you know. Relax and chill while we go and explore. Let's explore the throbbing areas. We, are, we already got the rebreather from the other cave and the machete. So let's check out those throbbing green areas and see what they hold. Two abandoned carts here. One dead guy, fortunately. Are these golf carts or something? Else? There is a cave over here. We're gonna go in. I wanna deal with that cannibal. Alright, so there's no signal in the caves, I will like to assume. Yes, yes, there is. There is no signal, okay. Food and dining, ah. Alright, looks like it's a food storage area inside the facility. Let's uh, let's have a look around, shall we? What's this? Thought you might find this interesting. We're calling it Artifact 1. Might be related to the cube you guys found. Perhaps. This appears to be the artifact back in the forest. Uh, I actually managed to find this one in the first game with my friends. That is definitely one of the artifacts. Alright folks, it looks like that's it for this area. We did manage to find some food. Collect uh, crossbow bolts from the bodies, but again, lots of dead bodies here, lots of food, resources, and we even got a clue about the artifact in the first game. Currently we are unable to go through since we were lacking a keycard here. So we'll just move on to the next one I suppose. We need a keycard for this one. So let's move on. Okay. Is having a bad hangover up there. I should just move on. Just keep moving. Just ignore that sound. I don't want to deal with that right now. Point of interest should be right around this area. You can see that there's a cart here. I don't see anything else. <laughs> Oh, there appears to be a cave here. All right, that's good. Hey there, Virginia. You chilling? <laughs> Careful. You, I gave you a hand the moment. Oh! 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 Damn. There's another guy right there. Good shot. Good, good shot. Good shot. Maybe once I find more weapon, I can give it to you. All right, let's just enter the cave. Oh wow.
We've got more resources. And we have a book here. Dimly blank. Parallel universes and time travel between them. like it's a new armor in the game and this must be a 3d printer yes oh we can we can print many things grappling hooks tech mesh I would like to so soon the tech mesh can make the armor sled 1000 milliliters oh that's a lot arrows a flask and a mask Definitely we need to print the mass, uh, the flask because we need to store water so that we can really need to store water in there so that we can just drink right there. And we got more resources in the room and some arrows. Also we can save and sleep on the bed. We found a flask that is very nice and can we print the mask? That'd be so cool. And we got a mask. Great. I'm not sure what the mask is for. But we have a mask. And we finally got a sled. And the sled is phasing through phasing through the printer. A 3D printer. Uh the game is early access, so that's bound to happen, I suppose. Let's see where this tunnel leads to. No. Oh. Well, again, similar to the first one that we went, we need an ID card. It seems to be we're missing it, so let's try exploring the other caves and see if they contain any of that stuff. Gold! Okay, gold, right. Terrible place to play golf then. Oh, can open them! We got the can open, great! Now we can open the can. I assume that we can open the can with a knife, but apparently well, we cannot. Stun baton. Oh, very nice. Very nice stun baton. Armor. 
God. What a, what a strange looking mineral. Is this what I think it is? The cross. We got a better weapon. Better than the firearm, ladies and gentlemen. We have the power of religion. What was this? This is what we are looking for. What is this exactly? I know not. It appears to be a mineral of some sort. These things. I'm not quite sure what they are, but they do appear to be a mineral of some sort. But anyhow, let's continue on with the exploration of this cave, spreading the word of Jesus, spreading the word of God with the cross. Hallelujah, ladies and gentlemen. Hallelujah. Hello there. The power of Christ compels you. The power of Christ compels you. Can you hit me? The power of Christ compels you. The power of Christ compels you. The power of Christ compels you. It doesn't seem to be working. We have time bombs on the ground for just such an occasion. Farewell. Here, the power of Christ compels you. 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 Power of Christ compels you. Power of I don't have any nades on me, but what I do have is a time bomb. Fuck you guys. <laughs> Decapitator. I have tried. I have tried showing the word of God to these creatures, and they do not seem to understand. But now they are in peace, for I have sent them to to heaven. Yes, to heaven. Don't worry, they are in peace now. Our Lord and Savior Jehovah, or Yahweh, or God, or whatever. The workers are having a lot of trouble getting anywhere inside these caves in complete darkness. We need more light in here. The safety hazard. Light it up like it's a Christmas tree. Oh, there, sir. You appear to be spreading your white stuff all over that dead person there. Uh, I don't think he's enjoying it. Within the box, you are safe, they say. Oh god. Okay, okay. Do I have any explosives? No, I do not. Come, foul creature. Meet your end. <coughs> Oh, 
Double booty. Missing guy we're looking for. Not sure if we're gonna find him. I hope so. The zip gun. The zipline gun, we got it, boys. Ah, the rope gun, not the zipline gun, the rope gun. Right, right, the rope gun. That it for the cave? That is it for the cave. Alright folks, we are officially back at base and you know it started snowing. Oh it is snowing outside, okay. It is snowing, ladies and gentlemen. Let me save the game. So for this episode we managed to actually go in in one of the trap two the trapping areas and one cave and we managed to find some really good stuff we managed to uh, find a 3d printer which managed to print a mask a flask and a sledge which is a sled i mean not a sledge sled yeah sled we also managed to find can opener the stun baton which is if you wanna commit police brutality, then I think the stun baton is really good against these cannibals. Uh, we also managed to find the uh, rope gun, which is really nice. And we still need a key card to open those doors, but yeah. That, I suppose that's it for this episode. Hopefully next one we'll find more stuff around the area. Again, I've, I've already finished the game with my friends, I'm just making this video to like show people where to get some of the items in the game. Oh, I forgot, we also got the cross, yeah. We also managed to get the cross, alright, great, very nice. 
Anyways, folks, uh, yeah, I'll see you folks in the next episode. Y'all, y'all have a good day now. I'm tired. I want to go to sleep, but yeah. See you folks next time.